I did that yesterday. I swear, bro. I don't know why people do their intros like that. Every time I will see a video like that, it'll just have me dead. I'll be like, no, stop it. Please stop it. As long as I can keep blood flow in my calf, you know, I feel like I'll be all right. If I was torn, I wouldn't be walking, right? I'm walking, right? Hobbling a little bit, but I'm still moving. So, fellas, that's why your girl keep asking, how you do that? All right, take note, y'all. You wondering who she DMing? DMing at 12, 16 at night. Everybody love to start their video off with like a hand clap. Like we in school or something. No, this ain't that. But good old machine leg day. Machine leg day meaning I'm not doing no squats, no lunges, uh, hack squat, leg press, none of that. All that is off the table today. I'm not gonna lie, my calf is bugging me Ooh. to the utmost. And it's like, oh my God, I can't, I can't deal. But we're making it work, you know what I'm saying? So, and this is how we make it work. Still going to train, still going to give it our best. I agree. Because one thing I've never done, and I will never ever do, I don't care if I'm hurting or whatever, don't stop working, don't stop training, you know what I'm saying? If it's hurting you, work around it, you know what I'm saying? Like how I'm about to do today. Only do machines if you got to, but never ever stop working. Deep, deep stretches as far as I can. Oh, shoot. Bro, now that, that stretch helps. So when you stretch some stuff like this, you can definitely get that deeper contraction. Deeper contraction, deeper fibers, twitching, all the stuff that you want. And like I said, for me, I'm all about control. So the way I start to set is how I try to finish it sounds easy but it ain't because watch when that weight start to build up on you Ugh. okay now today I'm really only gonna be doing machines because see this tape on my leg if you can. That got everything on hold. <laughs> like back order. That thing, yeah, this thing got everything on back order right now. But I'm still pushing, you know. Whew. But I'm telling you, it hurt when that thing, when, you, when I woke up, bro, my thing was swollen. I was limping all over the house, hobbling. Like, I know you'll be able to see it from this angle. So, see this? Yeah, this ain't the business. We got everything on back order. Everything on back order. So, when stuff like that happens with me, do I stop training? No. I'll just machine it up. You know what I'm saying? Work around this little area. So, that's because that's really all I'm doing today. You ain't going to see me pushing no squats or no hack squat, leg press. Here we go. So, since I'm doing machines today yeah i'm pretty much gonna max out you know because i ain't got to focus on stressing this out because today is leg day and my worst fear is going up there feeling like oh my legs is undersized which i know they not but when you were athlete that's the thought that those are the thoughts that go through your mind man so yep <clears throat> and like i said for me i'll stretch my glutes back or lean all the way back, you know what I'm saying? That way, everything is isolated. Ah, see that shake? Ah. Ah. Fellas, that's why your girl keep asking, how you do that? All right, take note, y'all. I'm trying to look out for y'all, so. You wondering who she DMing? DMing at 12, 16 at night. While you went to sleep, you know, getting ready for that eight to six. She trying to get her little, you feel me on? Whew. And this is how. <laughs> <laughs> somebody said in one of my, somebody said in the comments, it was like, why does he look like he's whispering or he's concerned with some, someone might say, it said something like that. Look here, man. This is a new gen, this is a, uh, 
it's another tw uh, planet fitness pretty much you know so i'm trying not to get kicked out of here right because there ain't too many there ain't too many locations where i'm at so i gotta make it work till i get up out of here so yeah because i hey what y'all don't know is uh it was like it was some years ago this was like when i first first came here this was like years ago right one of the trainers here he was like hey uh can you stop doing that and i was deadlifting right he was like can you stop uh deadlifting so loud all i had was like two plates and a quarter on there at the time and they still ain't got no platforms right still don't and now you got real life powerlifters in here just banging 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 so am i the cause of that <laughs> i don't know but it's, it's it's just funny though because i'll never forget that day bro and we in a yeah different type of neighborhood so if you know what that mean yeah like i said okay at least not right now let me get let me get a little bit higher in the ranks then i'll you know start making some people upset sending them home crying in the car <laughs> july 3rd before y'all start popping fireworks try to digest this in your head man don't run away from something just because it's bothering you right then and there keep blood flow going right when I say keep blood flow going, just keep blood in that area. Keep pumping, whether it's walking, climbing, or maybe not climbing. <laughs> but my point is, do something, man. Because if you go stale, you will get frail. You know what I'm saying? You're not going to come back. You're going to get worse than you was ever before. And to the people who think I'm telling lies, tell me, tell me otherwise then. Because who have you seen? I mean, okay. Now, I'm not talking about if you fully injured once again if you injured take that time to rest i'm just talking about if you hurt right this is how you keep that progress going even though you may be banged up a little bit but okay who cares Pump. <sighs> yep right there getting ready what am i getting ready for nothing <laughs> well i'm not getting ready for a show if that's what y'all are asking no uh strictly off season yes because my leanness keeps getting people confused no i'm not in a uh prep right now if i'm gonna be honest i can't wait to get back in prep though because once you go so long without it you get that itch just to let me get back in. Put me back in the game, coach. You know what I'm saying? When you that natural athlete, bro, you just know how to. Not gonna lie. I wish I could do calves right now, but I can't. <laughs> I can, but I have to do them very, very carefully. So my right calf, a little bit banged up, you know. Uh, stressed, strained, I, I would say. Not uh, torn, nothing, because if, if I was torn, I wouldn't be walking. I'm walking, right? hobbling a little bit but i'm still moving so gotta be a little bit careful how we get these calves but for the most part we're just gonna continue with these hams glutes quads and abductors i only spent 20 minutes in here and didn't even do nothing i might want to try some singles yeah let's try some singles see how these singles feel so if you want to do singles on a quad extension this is how you do them to where you can get a good stretch, good squeeze, and not mess up the formation for the opposite leg. This is what I've discovered. So, where is it? This one? Okay, so no. If you're doing the left leg, this if you ain't already got the uh, unilateral machine at your gym. Take opposite leg, put it up. Scoop that back just a tad, because it's going to help with that stretch, all right? Keep this leg locked in and you see, I can actually go a little heavier. Leg a little stronger than that. Um, oh, and then make sure that this little bottom pad is at an angle to where you only feel the quad pushing. If you feel anything else, you're doing it wrong. Ah, okay, yep, oh, nice. And then last but not least look up <clears throat> yeah <sighs> nice <sighs> 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 now 
this leg, we can just leave. <laughs> I did that yesterday. I swear, bro. I don't know why people do their intros like that. Like, hey, what's up, y'all? How's it going? Today? Bro, like, they just t they just turned the video on. They probably still in bed. Tell me how's it going today. We, we should be asking you that. You the creator. Sure. Every time I will see a video like that, it'll just have me dead. I'll be like, no, stop it. Please stop it. 